first day of the road trip. Just took a two hour tr uh, ride to Paris, about to get on a train for five hours, head straight to Antibes. My knees are finished. I cannot get on these little white vans. See that little van back there? Yeah, it is tough. Kills me. But I'm kind of late. I'm about to run on this train. I'm about to head to Antibes. Just got to Antibes. Long train ride. I think we're finna go to the hotel right now. Rest. Gonna practice in about three hours. That's how I be, man. You go straight from the train, straight to practice. That's it. Got to get this hotel room. Got Sia in here, hotel room. I think Sia about to get switched because we got a new American on the team. I think they want us together. My dog, Sia. Sia, what do you think about this game tomorrow? Hold on. It's a win. It's a win. I hope. You've been playing well, see. Are you going to play well again tomorrow? Yeah, for real, bro. I like the way you've been playing, see. Is it because you're my roommate or is it because it's you? It's the both. <laughs> <laughs> no, man, we just got the aunties in the hotel. We got about 30 minutes before we go take some shots. And I'm hungry, man. I'm just about to pass out. Got to go get these shots up. They got the distance. <laughs> oh. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, they got to go search the ball? Both of them? So he got he got to go get the ball. Oh, 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 easy work. Oh, oh. oh. Let's see what you got, Ben. Let's see what you got, Ben. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, 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 it came all around. So we shoot half-court shots. At the end of each practice, normally either you pluck behind the ear, or you gotta bring some food the next practice, or you gotta go search the ball. The ball. See, <laughs> they're throwing the ball all over the place. Now you gotta go to the whole gym to go get it. It's crazy. I don't ever lose this one. I lose the one with the food, but I don't ever lose this one. Oh, that's a good one, Sia. Oh, that's a good one, Sia. That's a good one, Sia. Fault in there, they shumble. That's your invite guy. That's your invite guy. Oh. Hey, hey, come on. Come. Peace net for you. <laughs> we just got back to the room. Uh, after shooting, had to switch uh, roommates. My guy, Effa, he just joined the team. He's going to be my roommate. I'm about to go downstairs and get some of this cuisine, some of this French cuisine. The food is not usually good, in my opinion. Yeah, so most of the time it's just pasta and olive oil and chicken. Sucks on the road, man. The last three road games, I didn't even eat. I just played on an empty stomach before the game and after the game. And I was dehydrated and just hungry, but... Better go see if I can stuff this down. Life on the road. So, just finished my morning walk <clears throat> in the beautiful Antibes. It's a lot of palm trees, a lot of beautifulness out here in the South, man. I love the South of France. Last night I came after dinner. I didn't vlog, but I ended up going straight to sleep. 
I was tired, man. I passed out. We have been traveling all day, and I just passed out. Right now, the next day, better go and get some breakfast before we got a morning workout. That's what my morning looked like. So here I am on the witch hunt. It's my problem with playing overseas, man. If you don't get lucky, you end up in a situation where you don't eat. Like I try, I just went to downstairs of the hotel and it was like six different types of bread. Like some square bread, some long bread, some croissant, some other shit. They had um, some ham, some cheese, and looked like some type of oatmeal situation. I don't know, bro, but I didn't eat. I had like a croissant and some orange juice. So now I'm walking. I found a grocery store. Sometimes I don't get lucky and find grocery stores, though. Sometimes you're in the middle of nowhere, nowhere to eat. So a couple of games, like the last two road games, I've been playing on empty stomachs because the lunch has been just as bad. We ain't really had nowhere to go. No, I never thought I had this problem playing pro, but I'm just not used to eating chicken with no seasoning on it, man. Rice with no sauce on it. Uh, not even sauce, rice with no seasoning. It's just rice. And I tried it, but it messes my stomach up more than it helps. So I just play hungry, I go to sleep hungry, or I eat a lot of fruits. But sometimes when I eat a lot of fruits, that's even worse, because then my sugar is so high. Most of the time, I just starve it. The side of playing over here that we don't show as much, but I said on this vlog, I'm gonna start being more transparent of the things that I really go through. But still fortunate to be doing what I love to do. Gotta adjust, we gotta adapt. That's what we do. We'll figure it out. So I ended up getting a quiche but it's like some eggs, some other stuff with some bacon in it. But that shit messed up my stomach too. But it's probably the only thing that I can actually swallow that I actually go down. And I got two uh, bread with chocolate in it and a drink. That's the best I can do because at the hotel it wasn't no better. But I wanted to go in the grocery store and thought I was gonna find like a bakery where they sell like a couple things, but nope. Bread, bread, bread. And if you ever been to France, you know they're serious about their bread. But you know, whenever I'm at home, I would eat like oatmeal or I could force down some eggs, some type of cereal. Uh, what else I eat? Some pancakes, French toast, sausage, bacon. You know, something like that. But just bread? It's tough, man. On my way back to the hotel, about a 15 minute walk. Try to get this down before we watch film and head to our morning workout. I was supposed to have a 20 minute walk, but it ended up turning into like an hour and a half, two hour walk on game day. Not happy about it, but no complaining over here, man. We're gonna find a way every time. I'm out. I only seen Ben lose one time in four years. Let's go. Yo. <laughs> I only seen this guy lose two times in four years. Jeez. What area you want? A gush? <laughs> Bam! So the day we plug the ear if you lose. Yesterday was catch the ball, today is plug the ear. This guy lost three times in a row, he had to buy the food. Who me though? You know what I'm saying? That's what we do. About to go back to the telly and get some food. So I don't know where we at in this vlog. I think we right after. Uh, I ate lunch. Lunch was terrible. <laughs> I 
I know my stomach is going to be feeling it tonight, but I ended up down and then I thought I was going to have to order Uber Eats, but I ended up just chewing it down right before the game, watching some YouTube videos, just winding down, F over there winding down, you know what I'm saying? Scratch my chin hair like that. Chat on, you about to go to the gym in about 20 minutes and start pregame and get ready for the game. I'll see y'all probably after the game. Hopefully it's a dub. Out. Seth, I need a shout out. Say so what's up, Seth. What's up, my man? I don't talk to French, I don't talk to English, I talk to my new command line here. My boy, David Johnson. Hey, yeah. Hey yo, that's Tyron. Just got back in the room. <sighs> Had a tough night tonight. My heel was killing me. Try to fight through it. I was frustrated the whole night. We got the W though. Had some, some I don't know what they try to feed us after the game, but I had to order Uber Eats. And that was a disaster too. <laughs> so it's late. My roommate is kind of, Better be knocked out so I can't be talking to y'all all night. Got an early train in the morning to head back to Paris. See y'all in the morning. <laughs> Got to head back to Paris. Just got some breakfast. Got a takeaway lunch, but yo, got a five hour trip. But I'm thoroughly impressed with whoever made train tracks. Like, bro, look at all these rocks, bro. Somebody did this for miles and miles and miles. Look at this, bro. I'm impressed. We got a quick flight to Paris, and then we head straight to practice. Get some more shots up. It never stops, man. Hopefully this meal I got on the train will give me some energy, because I'm finished right now. Tired man. So we came from Antibes, five hour trip, all the way back to Paris, straight from the train, straight back to the gym. Came back, ate some dinner. Dinner was a little bit better than that. No, dinner was terrible tonight. The rice was gummy. Um, 
Yeah, the chicken was okay, but the rice was gummy. It's crazy. I'm exhausted. I'm about to watch some basketball and go to sleep. One thing about doing this vlog, I'm happy that I've been doing it. I'm noticing how negative I am and how I'm always and where my frustration stems from. I'm noticing that whenever you don't have the food you want to eat, whenever you can't speak the language, whenever you kind of always by yourself, I'm always, I've always been numb to those feelings and to those, those social interactions because I'm like, okay, 10 months, I gotta, you know, I just gotta, normally I say, man, 10 months, I just gotta put up with it. But I've been here seven years. So now it's like, <laughs> I gotta find another solution because when you always isolated, you never like the food, you gotta do a lot to get your spirits up every day. And doing these vlogs, I'm noticing how sometimes I can be so negative and um, I just had a meeting with the coaches and everybody about two or three weeks ago. To, they were showing me how negative I was on the court and how it was impacting my game and also the team, team, my teammates' game. And it's been helping me. You know, I've just been checking my attitude. Last night in the game, it got the best of me, though, because um, my heel was kind of killing me last night. So I couldn't do what I wanted to do on the court. And I, I don't think I scored but one point in the first half but I didn't get a lot of touches. But, you know, I was getting frustrated, but then I thought about it. Well, I can't really move because of my heel, like I want to move, so I, I'm not actually getting open a lot. And it was playing pretty tough D on me. It was denying me a lot. But um, yeah, these vlogs, man, that's why I like them because they get to show me who I am and I can assess myself and look myself in the mirror or I look myself in the camera and tell my show, show it, I can see how negative I can be and it's just something I got to work on because it'll help me as a teammate and a player and as a person overall. So, yeah, man, I just wanted to get that ran out. Um, this vlog is pretty long, I think. If you guys like this style, please let me know. But I'm about to get some shut eye, man. It's like 11 o'clock. I'm about to shut it down. Big game against Paris tomorrow. I got to get my energy. I'm out. <sighs> Shoot around was cool this morning. Just finished lunch. Lunch was, was okay. It wasn't good, but it wasn't bad. It wasn't disgusting. It was good. It was all right, you know. Um, I'm about to take me a little nap, like an hour, 30 minutes. Just trying to be positive today, man. See if it translates to my game. So I'm not worrying about the, the food too much. I'm just gonna be positive about everything and see how it translates. And just even me as a person, just being a better person, just being appreciative and thankful that I'm fortunate to have meals. So, about to take my meal, watch a little bit of film, get ready for the game. Let's put it. exhausted back to this pretty little thing over here <laughs> it's the end of the vlog it's been a long four days uh, maybe five days but we ended up winning the game last night I played terrible until overtime I shot four from 16 this was a tough night I didn't vlog much because I was trying to focus on the game after the game I was pretty frustrated, but all in all, we got the win in overtime in Paris against a good Paris team. And, and man, during the game, I just felt like I was rushing. Felt like I was trying to do too much. I was trying to hit the big shot. I was trying to uh, get a momentum swing. Just trying to do too much. You know, and the way teams play defense on me, they kind of stick to me. So whenever I get free, I'm like, woo! The next thing you know, I done 
rush the shot and it's like a brick. So we got the window, man. Everybody contributed. Everybody played well. We played great on defense. Uh, we fought. It was a fight last night. We play Paris again next week. Uh, yeah, next week. And we got to get back to it. But it's the end of the vlog. I'm ending right here. I'm about to go to the gym right now, actually, and get some shots up because that was just terrible. <laughs> that was just terrible shooting last night. And I got to go see the ball go through the net. So thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you like this style of video. I'll do more. If not, I wouldn't do, I won't do more, but kind of takes a lot to keep pulling your phone out all the time because I had to vlog the whole time on my phone because it's kind of weird when you're around all those, te all the teammates and you pull out the, the big camera and, you know, you can't really film too much because of privacy, you know, with the team, we going over our schemes and stuff like that. And they don't really like the cameras around like that anyway, so. Try to record as much as possible. But once again, man, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe. Till next time, I'm out.